Hey guys, it's Wolf your one only. Today we're going to be playing World Neverland. I found this game on Google Plus and it seemed interesting. It seemed like it was like sort of like walk around making your own life or something like that. Something like that. But we're going to be trying it out and seeing how it is. Without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, we got some agreements. Yep. Okay, now we got to download stuff. So I'll be right back after this. I, I kind of suspected it. <laughs> All right, there we go. Uh, choose my character. That's the sound of that. <laughs> you chose female last time. Let's choose Mel. Um. Oh, I was trying to change the color. So there are up to seven hairstyles. I think that's as close as, as we're going to get. I was say, we need eye color, man. Where's that green? I kind of like these eyes a little bit. Just because of the glow. But then again. Alright, so there are like a lot of eyes. Do you want to change the eye color though? Definitely not a huge fan of just the normal blue eyes and stuff like that, but eh. Oh, it changes var varying. Okay. It must be really obsessed with blue eyes. Oh, we're just gonna have no eyes then. <laughs> You'll never get to see our eyes with glasses. Oh, we can have a beard and mustache too. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Last name, uh. Damn, I never thought of like last name for games. God damn it. Let's go for wing. Personality, cool, gentle. Where is. Lazy. <laughs> yeah, I think of myself as street smarts. Oh god. Guys. I'm six years old. <laughs> Wait, hold up, hold up. Oh, oh, okay. I, I was about to say, guys, uh, I'm not of age. <laughs> FBI, open up! <laughs> Alright, creating my character. You can also change areas. Oh, no, that was just, that wasn't even a tip. It was just basically saying that download again, Barry. Okay, I wouldn't even know what the hell that is. Oh. So claim all my rewards or they disappear. You didn't even tell me what I can do. <laughs> okay. So 
so I can climb stuff too. I'll climb up the stairs. Wow, I had to do that just to climb up stairs. I can also fast travel. Wow. Uh, fast travel. Oh my god, why didn't you just zero in on one location? <laughs> oh, fast travel is just fast run, <laughs> apparently. God damn, dude. Look how small I am. How fast I am. I'm fast as fuck, boy. I am talking to you right now. Uh, I could actually sit down. Ah, okay. I can even place food. I have business with you, apparently. What are we sending text messages like to each other? Ah, uh, sure. Okay, so you can go back and look at the older stuff. Well, he said leave it to me. All I thought about was just Sora saying that word. Well, saying that exact sentence. Oh, I have to save my game myself? It's multiplayer, though. Okay. Well, then. Okay, so I gotta set up a count. Where the hell do I find that? There it is. You can look at my quest while I travel. Nope. Nope. Apparently if you do that, it just stops you. Okay, so you can actually go to your quest and pick it too. You don't actually have to go to fast travel and do that. Noted. Noted, noted, noted. Give me your herbs, dude. I guess I'm in an the area. They're not going to tell me where everything is. Cool. I figured. So we found one of the herbs we needed. I found a fossil? What? Okay, so I need to find no seeds. Sometimes you can't tell what the hell is a bot and what the hell is not. I mean, look at all those characters. Look at all of them. Really? I was about to say, I must be missing something, but there's a lot of stuff in here, apparently. Okay, yeah. There's one. Yeah, I know. I already, I already looked at it. We need one more. Unless we got it. Which I don't think we did. Yeah, I figured. Alright, got my last one.
I even carried the stuff in my hand. I wonder, can I zoom in? Any? I don't think I can. I got your stuff. I have business with you. And here is your quest. Yeah, psh, dude, I'm a savage, sure. Got nothing else better to do. I gotta go fish? Say no more. I am all about fish. This is number one fishing champ right here. <laughs> Alright, let's go to them. Hey, so far it's actually a pretty neat game. Basically just showing you a lot of jobs and stuff. It kind of reminds me of... Um, God damn it. I couldn't even remember the name of that. Where you like grow stuff and fish. Whatever the hell that game was. <laughs> I think I interrupted it. Oh no, I'm here. God damn it, I forgot I have to climb downstairs by double clicking. Where is it? Did I claim. I was about to say, did I even claim my stuff? No, I didn't. It wasn't even telling me if I had any things to claim. Oh, there we go. We got this. Dude, this guy... I am a fishing champion. Oh, we got a big one. Alright, you hooked that big one. Tap on the screen until the HP strength... Oh, until the fish strength drops to zero. Okay, so basically just like a clicking game. Ah! Do I'm a freaking clicking master? Oh no, not again. Is that what? I think we need one more. Oh no, we need uh, three more actually. No, two more. <laughs> Math. There we go. So if I know correctly, there is also like fighting too just like a normal MMO but you can do like other stuff too I was wondering if there was like you know different jobs you can like take on but it seems like it's an actual state up like role play to where you can just sit anywhere you want you know order food stuff like that it seems like it has a lot of interactions you guys sell us like carrying the fish and carrying the herbs and stuff like that. Yeah, seems like a very legit role playing type of game. Alright, go to the market.
right, so there's a general store, work supplies. Oh, grocery store is general store. Combat supply. So yeah, you can go out and fight things too. Oh no, this is the grocery store right here. I need a flower from you. All right, coming back to you. Right, I am a speed demon. I can finish any quest. You got any other quests you got? Oh. Ah, so you can become a citizen, I guess, help out around the, um, around the kingdom where you become a adventurer. I'm just probably like, reading into that. I mean, <laughs> could probably be what it is. Oh, actually, I think I was right. Even children can go there. Damn, what a bunch of savages. You even let them fight boss monsters? Do we have like a hunger meter too? That actually be pretty interesting. Have a little bit of survival in it. try a place in order give me some of that oh my work and combat skills okay so you can work around the kingdom too and be, and be a citizen and you can go out as an adventurer I was right Okay, cool. Oh, my speed and stuff increase. Fuck yeah, dude. Let's go. <laughs> Alright, at the Castle Street. So, Castle Street, now I have to go forward into Castle Gates Street. Oh, then I'll go left? Huh. Into the wooden bridge. No, no, no. I remember my pathing of how to get here now. No, I don't want to invite people. Wait, what? You didn't tell me how to equip my weapon. Okay, so this is my combat setting. Okay, I can't see anything if it's traveling. There we go. Change weapon. I think I'm going to take the axe. We can even set up our own skills for combat. We can also enhance our weapon. Have that to remove. Select the shard. I don't think we have any shards. Yeah, we don't have any shards.
Oh, what the hell? Uh, I guess we'll invite. Why not? Oh. So I can auto two. We got a counter. So I need CP to do certain skills. I'm guessing this is an AI with me or an actual team. I'm not sure. I'm so confused at that point. I think I know what they're they're bidding. This is my CP, so I can go one. Oh, or my teammate could just destroy that thing. <laughs> so this is the combat of the game, huh? Interesting. What a savage. <laughs> I might as well just chase the gun at this point, right? <laughs> oh, he found a chest. Oh, so... Now everybody gets an item. Whew. So there's traps, too. Noted. Okay, so make me a little bit worried. So when they say you lose all the XP that you gain, is it just like through the stage or is it like risk like high risk of going in here? If it's high risk of going in here, that's interesting and also very terrifying. Look at all the badass kids that are going in there. A bunch of savages. <laughs> like damn dude. I'm going back to standard sword. I, I don't feel like I've gotten enough of this down. I want to try it. They're just fighting some people. Oh, the kids. <laughs> There's kids literally fighting with me. What a bunch of savages. Oh, of course. I took the damage. Alright kids, thanks for showing me up. Telling me I'm basically a noob. <laughs> Alright, so that's my defense. This is my attack. Okay, I get it. I get it. I'll heal all you guys. There you go. Nobody took any damage but me, but you know, we, we can all still heal together. So each, so pretty much each fight you have like a CP that you could just spin for like a combo. The more you combo, the more damage it it does. Noted. Yeah, I know about the auto combat. I just have not wanted to do it.
Yeah, sure, we can continue on. Okay, so you can keep traveling as much as you want. Seems like I'm just carrying the whole team here. Okay, so we found another chest. Wait, do you say we can get sword or weaker than sword? I'm not sure. I'm gonna have to go back and look at that again. But yeah, guys, that's that's pretty much it. That's where we're gonna leave it. Okay, so those are my uh, shards that level up my weapon. But that has been World Neverland. Pretty much a standard um, RPG where you can just role play your life, you know, become a citizen. Or become somebody who goes on adventures. You know, protect the castle, become a knight or something. There's a lot of works and jobs, apparently, that you can go through, too. So that's actually pretty cool. You can even add your friends, I think. I'm still not sure if these are, like, NPCs or actual characters. I think they're all NPCs, actually. I think this is a solo game, maybe? I'm not sure, but, but it's cool as hell, though. It's cool as hell, cool as hell, at least. I'd say try it out. And with that said, I'll see you guys on the next one. Until then, peace out. You got to lose.